Ladies and gentlemen, viewers across the globe, we send our deepest apologies for not uploading in who knows how many weeks. Guys, we apologize. We've been busy, not with car stuff, but um, yeah. But coming back around, ladies and gentlemen, we've got a lot to show you. So starting things off, we got sport bikes, so we've been having a blast on these suckers. So I got a 2005 Yamaha R6. Tyler has a 2008 Suzuki SV 650 600. A lot of fun. All right, guys. I know we've been talking about a big surprise for a long time. Um, so you guys know the EGs have been through some, you know, some hard times. Um, so that's why I introduced to you the big surprise on my end, my new vehicle, another EG Honda Civic hatchback. Alright guys, you know I love these EGs, they're just the best, they're unbeatable, I love them to death. I'm now a proud owner of three of these suckers, I got two white ones and a blue one. Um, this thing's great, I picked it up from this really nice old lady, one owner from California. It's got 200,000 miles and it's very clean and it comes with the blue interior, which also this has. So this build is going to be the final build. We're pretty much going to swap everything from this one, throw it on here, and this is going to become the final vision and you guys are going to be pumped to see it. A um, little update on the crown. Um, she's still around, but um, it's just a pain to register. Um, Tyler missed his certified VIN inspection because he got pulled over on the way there and he still got a ticket for it. So that was kind of a sticky situation. But um, news for this, I already have headlights that I've been waiting for for a while that I got off a Japanese auction. So these are straight from the motherland. Big fat LEDs in the front. Pretty aggressive, I'd say. So those are going to look really sweet. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we've got both the EGs here. Um, we got Lori Civic, the lady I bought it from. We got that in the air. We just had everything with some WD-40 so it comes off nice and easy because we've been through this before. And uh, this one was just the trial EG, so we're going to do everything properly and responsibly on the new one. So yeah, we went through, hit everything with WD-40 so it'll come out nice and smooth. And now we're going to start taking apart the suspension on the OG EG. New Civic, all the suspension is completely out of it. We're currently putting the stock suspension back into this guy. There's the strut. About to zap it in. It don't even look right. The, the Civic is stock again up here. It doesn't look right. We got to jack it up ages more to get the wheel on it just i think it's because it's no fender it looks like it's such a big gap to travel but yeah so we're gonna get this wheel put on and then we're gonna probably do a time lapse of us uh knocking out that uh the new civics driver's side before we're getting into everything we raised up the coil over probably like inch and a half two inches because Sadly, the car's going to go on stock wheels again, um, just so I can drive to the emissions and then a certified VIN inspection and all that. So it's not going on the Meisters quite just yet. Alright guys, everything's in, we got the coilover, our aftermarket control arm, our aftermarket drop fork, and that's everything for now, so we're going to slap the wheel on and call the front driver's side good.
uh, both front ends. Coilovers dropped a little low, so we'll see. It might look a little funny, but this is back to stock, so it's up in the air. And we don't know if the car's happy to be up in the air or wishes it was back down low. Still got the rear. Uh, it low key slammed. I didn't intend for this. All right, we pizzaing. We're done for the night. We got this guy lifted up and this guy lowered down. So we're gonna do the same on the back tomorrow. We'll hit y'all then. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is now Thursday. We got the fronts finished up last night. So now we're gonna move to the back and do the same thing, swap all the suspension and put this on all the modded suspension and this is going back to stock. Rear suspension is almost completely disassembled. We got that out. And yeah, almost time. Last aftermarket part coming out of the rear driver's side. Take a look at that. Driver's side is all finished up. We got the strut in, the control arm in, the lower control arm in, the subframe brace in. So everything's good, tightened down. Um, the other side, we just have to get the strut put up and then the bolts on and then tighten the coil over and then we're good. David? Um, we're gonna do a quick oil change on this sucker because the oil is Nasty, nasty. Look at that. That's black. But we done with everything suspension wise. guys it says we has a, uh, have about a six minute wait at emissions so we're here uh, just chilling out until we get a pull into a bay and get this sucker tested all right they said they're unable to test it because the front end is too low which doesn't make sense because the front end is genuinely not that low. I know we like making stance cars and whatnot, but we raised it up a whole hell of a lot. So I guess we might go home and try and raise it or leave it for tomorrow. Alrighty, we speed running the fork swap. 
Alrighty, record time and we're back on the road. We back. been here before you know. All right, Devin. Still too low. Still too low. All righty. Hopefully third time's the charm. Word. So we finished up with the Civic today, he passed emissions, so we're good to go. Um, that's pretty much, that's gonna be it for today. Civic's good, we got a bunch of stuff. The headlights, the wheels are going on, more camber, more lower. Um, we're gonna do stuff to the crown soon, but we just gotta wait till Tyler goes to that certified VIN inspection before we can start. So yeah, that's gonna be it for today, guys. Thank you for watching, sorry we haven't uploaded in ages, but yeah, more to come soon. See ya.